Excuse G'day, me, mate. How, how much you spend for rent in New York? Caleb Simpson, the what's you, you pay for rent in New York? Guy has taken the internet by a storm when he toured his people's apartments in New York City. Now I bumped into him in the street the other day. Oh, you're that guy. You want to come cook me a meal right now? Is that cool? And let's just say when I went and cooked for him in his apartment, things got a little interesting. Dude, welcome to my home. This is it? Yeah, this is it. This is the humble abode. Check it out. Whoa! You actually have like a kitchen in New York City. In this video, we're gonna flip the script on Caleb, where he usually tours someone's apartment. I'm gonna tour his and specifically his kitchen, finding out what he has in his fridge. Now the challenge I face is making sure he has the best meal to come out of his apartment. The problem is, his roommate is also a weapon of a cook. By the way, team, in the last video, Kelly Wakasa roasted Caleb. So stick around till the end of the episode where I show Caleb the video itself and see his reaction. How much do you spend a month on food? Oh yeah, probably $2,500 a month Cool. on food. $2,500 a month, which is actually above average, I would say. Uh, but clearly, what have you been doing with those food? Like, do you cook? Do you cook at all? I don't. Saul, do I cook? Judge is ruling. You, you used to sometimes throw something in the oven. No, no. Negative? And I don't spend any time on food. If I could take a pill and just eat that pill okay. and not have to eat, I like would. Oh man. I'm like that person. To Caleb, food sounds like a bit of a chore. So I'm gonna play Cupid and help him fall back in love with tasty meals. All right, should we check out the fridge? Here we go. What's in the fridge, big man? Double door, huge, wow, dude. What are these? Curds. Is this pumpkin puree? <laughs> there's so much food in here. Well, there's one thing we could do. What's that? We could just order out. You just go straight to like whatever delivery platform you want to go to. I don't actually use the delivery platform. You walk? Hardly ever. Yeah, I'll walk or See? go pick up. Nice. Well then, dude, how do you pick up chicks if you don't know how to cook? I'm famous. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta think of something super creative. Not you know famous. what? Let's go think by the fireplace. Oh. Genius. So really? You just have a, a nice sit down. Are you a big spoon? I'm, I'm whatever's needed, you know, in that moment. Oh man, this is kind of therapeutic. Haley, you gotta, Haley, you gotta tell us about up, your chef? dish. You gotta tell us about your dish really quick. I already had the challenge of trying to make him the best meal of his life. Now I have competition. I think we need to test the competition, right, dude? The apartment <laughs> yeah. smelled like heaven when I walked in. Okay, well, that was our plan. Okay. <laughs> we need to sit down and do the full British Bake Off. Haley, what have you brought us here today? So we have the stickiest of pudding, mm. um, a lot of dates, a lot of pumpkin puree, more than any recipe would ask for. So could this dish send you home today? I'm, I'm afraid, I know I f***ed up last time. Mm. Well, we'll have to wait and see what the judges have to say. I'll, ju I'll jump in, in bro. My heart is going right now. <laughs> wow, okay, know. nice little entry. It's absolutely f good. I'm not yeah. going home. But the best thing about that home is here. Domination. Domination. Speaking of domination, it's time to dominate your kitchen. <laughs> yep, it's time to get to work. So this is what we're working with. We have eggs, oats. I might use the yogurt or I might use the ice cream. Maple syrup, thank you Canada. Berries, more berries, more berries. And you guessed it, berries. How much? A bit more. More? A bit more. more. A little more. Oh, that's enough. This is like that spaghetti scene. Yes. You know from Elf. Nope. <gasps> Interception! <laughs> Alright, now get mixing. Do you have a mixing spoon? Is that correct? That, that works. As long as I mix together, I don't care. Okay, cool. <laughs> We're getting in there, baby. So, bro, how long have you actually been touring New York City apartments? Well, it's not even New York City apartments anymore. How long have you been touring apartments for? The concept started like three months ago, but I've been making videos online for seven years. So what was your su subscribers on YouTube at three months ago? 15,000 subscribers. Now I'm about to hit 1.5 million. Yeah, so if you want this to work, you need to just stand there and hold it. Hold it? Yeah. If you don't mind, if you could just do that the whole time, that'd be great. Yeah, I love that idea. It's great. I won't let go. You can take your hand off the light bulb for a second. Okay, put it back on. <laughs> we made this delicious crumble, the beautiful sauce on the base, and the ice cream. And we typically would eat the table, but... Caleb is a bit different. Okay, here we go. I need one more bite. Just to double check. Oh, wait, there's something really good in there. I think I need one more bite. Just to double check. Pretty good. No, it's not bad, bro. As making Caleb the best meal of his life would have taken a lot more time, I found a loophole. So, serious question. 
Is this the best meal you've ever eaten in your bathtub? <laughs> yes. <laughs> Yeah! <laughs> and now team, the moment you've all been waiting for. Caleb's reaction to Kelly's video. Okay. Wait, okay. what? Yeah, like Caleb. <laughs> Lame ass TikToks. I was only on yours to so I could get on Dan's. Kelly was talking? Yeah, you had it, bro. We got six million on our TikTok. We're gonna get six point one. Yep. Kelly. It took me three months to hit a million subscribers on YouTube, <laughs> and it took you ten years. <laughs> oh shit! <laughs> Fucking mic drop. <laughs>